it's always a reminder of what it is that I truly want to do with my life, and that's, that's music. All of my tattoos have to do with music. Uh, I'm married to music. On my back I have two guitars for my parents, um, who were both musicians. So I wanted to include a guitar in with a symbol of, because I do like classical music and softer stuff as well, so um, that's why I wanted to include birds. Stevie Ray Vaughan, the peacock. Then I have a lot of portraits of just music influences. I have Stevie Nicks. The Mike Muir portrait. Dolly Parton. The Gigi Allen. And um, Prince is my latest one. And Janis Joplin. Janis Joplin's Lyle Tuttle uh, tattoo. The Black Flag. And Metallica. Really psychobilly music and I'm, I have a horror pops tattoo on my calf. The Grateful Dead tattoo on the back is notes from Touch of Grey that say, I will get by, I will survive. Give me danger, that's an Iggy Pop reference. I paint rock and roll. First 50 that I've ever painted that I sold out of was John Lennon, so that's why that one's tattooed. Jimi Hendrix one is coming soon, so I just want to tribute what he's been in my life and just kind of how he's been represented as an icon. It's Dead Boys, and they're my favorite band, and I'm obsessed with music. The Lizard King for Jim Morrison. They all died at 27. It's the reason for 27. Well, it says, like, lick on my leather. Pretty much means, you know, I'm going to live my life how I want to live my life. And I'm tattooing it on my arm so you all know that I'm not changing, I guess.